you are going to come in professionaltutorial.com and here is a link install mac os mojave virtual box windows and i will also provide the link of that page in the description of that video you can easily find that one and uh, further you are going to come here and all information and detail are written here but uh, i'm also going to tell you that in this video with very easy steps here is the content and you need some software for that one first one which you are going to download that is virtualbox you have to download that one and install like all other uh, softwares you are going to install that is completely easy then there is there are a file for mac os mojave which is the september 24 2018 update and you have also august 10 2018 uh, update as well here is two files one is one full file if you were, your internet is very fast then you are going to download that one file if your internet is slow then you are going to download one by one that link which has all six files when you are going to download that one you will get you will get like these this one and it is a winrar file and if you don't have winrar then you are also going to download winrar from here then you are going to come in the in the file which you have already downloaded and right click on that one and just extract here then you will get the file which is like make os mojave 10.14 b6.vmdk file and after that one you are going to just open your virtual box which i have here and we are going to open that one right now i am going to just click on new and we are just going to write here make os mojave and uh, no matter if you are going to write any name that is not a problem then you are going to just take a type which is make os x and you are going to take make os x 64 bit and then you are going to click next here that is the memory size of the ram uh, whatsoever you have memory like now i have uh, 16 gb and therefore i'm going to give the 8 gb to the virtual box if you have 8 gb then you are going to give 4 gb to the virtual box it means that you are going to give 50 percent of your virtual box uh, space which has a ram now you are going to click next again then you have hard disk then you are going to select use an existing virtual disk file and you are going to click that small icon which is a folder then the uh, the file which you have downloaded and extracted that which is vmdk you are going to select and open now you are going to create that one and after that one you are going to click setting and in setting you are going to come like uh, in a uh, system and you have processor i have eight core processor I'm going to give the 50% of that one to the virtual box and if you have like four then you are going to give two to the virtual box for installing Mac OS Mojave and now we are going to select display and you are going to take that one to eight MB maximum and storage you are going to use host input output cache and now you are going to click OK and after that one you are going to click close the virtual box and i'm also going to close that one you are again going to come in the website and uh, at the bottom you will get a code like this one and all the procedure is also written that how you are going to use that one but i'm going to show you in this video you are going to copy that one copy and now we are going to open notepad and we are going to write here the uh, we are going to paste in notepad now again we are going to just open cmd and open that as a administrator and uh, just say yes and now we are just going to edit some file uh, for that one i will just again open virtualbox and after that one setting 
and we are going to copy the name of that and now close VirtualBox completely and we will come in the edit replace now what we are going to do we are going to replace with and uh, we are going to write the name of OS which we have just given that in VirtualBox and then we are going to find that one your VM name which means it means that virtual machine name and now you are going to see that all of these will like these that one will change and we are going to just click replace all and now they are they have been changed now close that one and select one by one and uh, then enter now select the second one and enter now select the third one and i'm also just pressing ctrl c for copy and now the fourth one and uh, we are going to select that one as well and now we are going to select that two one and uh, after that one we are going to press enter and we are going to select the last one and press enter now you are going to just write exit and uh, we are going to click on virtual box and then you are going to start your virtual box now it will take some time to start the virtual box and then you will also see that if everything is all right and fine you will just get the display screen now you can see that the make os is starting right now and uh, everything is working all right and fine and we are going to see further that what problem we have okay as you can see that we have welcome screen and uh, we are going to select that one but uh, i have clicked in that one and it is saying that if you are going to then right click then when we are going to right click then we will just release our mouse i will just say okay no problem and uh, you can see now my why my that mouse is not working if i'm going to write and that is one of the problem which i have also mentioned in the article at the bottom in troubleshooting you will find that if mouse and keyboard not working in the mac os virtual box then uh, you have to download that free uh, download virtual box extension and after downloading you will get a file a file here and uh, it will say that install that one and you are going to install that one then uh, after that one you are going to come in setting once again and in setting you have like uh, usb and you are going to select usb 3.0 controller and press ok now i will just select the country which is like usa and we are just going to select that one like united state okay united state and continue and here is our keyboard i will just press continue since i'm using the us version that's fine then uh, that is the data and privacy you will just continue and read each and everything then uh, here is like how do you want to transfer don't transfer any information i will click on that one because i don't want to be transfer anything right now just press continue and here you are going to write like apple id but i'm not going to write anything if you have apple id you are going to write that one or create a new one but for now i will just set up that later and it is asking that are you sure you want to skip signing with an apple i will say that yes skip that one then you will get a new window after that one and that is like term and condition definitely we agree with term and condition and it is saying i have read and agreed to the make a software license agreement i will just say agree and then you are going to write like full name i will write jim shedraza and account name something and password i will write password and here i will write is always 
then we are going to click continue and then it will set up the operating system for us it will take a little bit time after that one you will get the express setup setting and we are just going to say continue and here are like two version which is the dark version and the light version i will let the default light version and press continue and then it will set up the mac mojave 10.14 and it will take a little bit time and that and after that our system or, or our operating system may be completed we will wait a little bit as well now you can see that our make os mojave is right now completed and everything is working fine like i will just press continue and let me just and we are just going to see that now it is installed but the problem is that one if i'm going to increase size of that one it will not work but i have also written that one in the article that if you have problem like uh, with full screen mode then what you are going to do you are just going to uh, add everything from here if again if you have a problem for resolution then you can write that in comment box below otherwise i will solve or make one new video as well i hope you got the idea that how that will work for example if i'm going to click on that about this mac and you are going to say see that mac os mojave version 10.14 and uh, 8 gb ram which i have just put on the virtual box and we have 3.3 gigahertz and that is four core and display is like 3 mb and uh, everything is working fine great amazing and if you have any problem or you want to say anything you can just write that in the comment box below if you like that video please thumbs up if you want to just uh, tell that about your friends then you share that maybe it will be helpful for all of your friend as well and if you have not subscribed yet subscribe my channel for more amazing videos and also press the bell icon i hope you got the basic idea how you are going to install make os mojave in 10 uh, 10.14 in windows 10 using virtual box thank you everyone goodbye